What's good, YouTube? This your man, Spill Dog. You know, man, when I see Zoo fight, I, I just don't see no hella. I don't see no hella, no hella of a fighter like y'all. A lot of y'all saying in the comment section, uh, this dude slow as hell. He 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 flat footed. He he, you know, he only fight one way. His defense is suspect. And I mean, shit, but I I I, I don't I don't see. To be honest with you, man, I watched I watched Key fight Mario Barrios. And I watched, um, and I watched, and I watched TM Zoo fight the dude uh, Mendoza. And y'all telling me that guy right there can't be beat, uh, TM Zoo? I don't know if he was just playing with this dude with a weapon, man. Shit, it, man, them punches coming out so slow. It, I look at his feet. I don't like the way. It, I don't like his foot placement. Uh, shit, man. I. I this this is definitely a uh, man. I, I gotta put a little something on this fight, man. I ain't gonna tell you no lie, man. Um, he definitely beatable. He ain't got a chance in there with Terrence Crawford or uh, Earl Spence. I don't think. I, I, he just too fucking predictable, man. Uh, I mean, you can you can sit back and basically just. I mean, he's too predictable and slow. I mean, uh, I see why Keith picked this fight now. Now, what he will do. And stay right there in front of you, and put that mental mental pressure on you, cause the you know because you know he right there and he study coming. I don't know how hard he hit, but he better have some hell of hell of power on them punches, cause he right there to be hit. I mean, he is there to be hit, and I think Keith. I think Keith. Shit up. If 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 Keith just fight a little, just a little bit of his old self. I think he got this, man. Uh, this dude ain't showed me shit. You know, uh, I, I've been looking at because I've been trying to figure out what what's the hype about. You know, what's the hype? The hype is his last name. His daddy was a bad. It was a bad dude. You know, uh, I ain't saying this cat can't fight, but I, he damn sure beat a bowl. But I mean, I don't see. It's a whole lot of people I think on uh going 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 to touch him up. Might maybe I'm wrong, but. Man, that dude's slow as hell. I mean, uh, his head standing right there. I ain't seen him rock his head. All the fights I seen him fight, I ain't seen him rock his head. Ain't no slip slide in him. Uh, he just gonna walk forward on jabs and big shots. I mean, shit, that ain't hard to prepare for. I mean, it ain't hard to prepare for. Only, like I say, only thing that could that I I would have to say with Keith. To time out the ring, but he took two and a half years out the ring when he fought Mario Barrios, and you know what? The, the best thing could have happened for Keith is that he went twelve rounds in that fight. Seriously, he he needed to get all them rounds in, you know, just to cause cause the inactivity and how long he stayed out the ring. And I think them twelve rounds with Mario Barrios is going to serve him well in this fight right here because Barrios was taller and had a longer reach. And faster than Tim Zoo, and now he didn't have the power that Zoo got, but he taller, faster, and 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 more reach, which gave Keith problems in the first in the like first two rounds of uh, trying to get inside without getting caught. You know, now Keith got to be able to take Zoo punches. That is the only thing that you that that's the only thing um, I can see Keith got to worry about. Will that power be something he can handle? And I don't think it will. Uh, I didn't see no. I didn't see no. You know, like I, I said the other day, uh, Triple G. But he ain't got that. Ain't that shit. He ain't got no. He ain't got no G G G in him. He a good. He a good solid fighter. But he look like a B level fighter to me. I hate to say it. He look B level. And for his dad to have a jab that he had, this dude jab is slow. He paw with it. I mean, you know. I, 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 he definitely beatable. If Keith hadn't have been out the ring so long, I would just say I know he gonna knock this. I I, I know he gonna uh, beat this dude. I ain't gonna say knock him out, but I know I, if he had been fighting anywhere consistently, I wouldn't even had no. I mean, I, I don't even think it'd be a fight. I think Keith would just dance him all around the ring all night, which I think is what's gonna happen to him. You know, uh, he. I mean, I don't think I don't even think he cut the ring off all that good. If you ask me, Tim Zhu, uh, I have I'm just you know I watched him fight uh, Mendoza, I watched the fight with Gaucho or whatever. Now he do got he got a nasty uppercut 
that that right uppercut, you know, that's that's a hell of a punch. He got a, a mean overhand right. I mean, he got a few things to his repertoire, but for the most part, he's slow as hell, flat footed, and come in and straight right there in front of you. Shit, you you can't miss him. So, shit, if Keith got it, if Keith still got his legs, I see why he took this fight. And this is this would be a this is definitely a good fight to get back on to get uh get back in the game with you know to show people you still want to fight for a title but you know I think this dude is more of his name than a fighter Tim Zhu I mean I'm I keep looking at his fights I'm trying to see that I'm trying to find this monster everybody talking about and I ain't seen him yet I ain't seen nothing scary about this dude as a matter of fact. I see a guy that's deaf, that, that, that shit, I don't give a damn how, I mean, he can be beat. I wouldn't have no problem throwing certain fighters up in the ring with him. He, he wouldn't have a chance with Boots, wouldn't have a chance with Bud. I mean, this dude would get blew out of there by some of the 147 pounders. Wouldn't have a chance with Charlo. Uh, man, I, I, he, he, he talking about, you know, uh, keep the first name on the list. It better be a damn short list because I don't see you going much farther than this. Uh, if he get past Keith Thurman, real talk, you know. Uh, but that's it for me on this video. If you like the video, to like and subscribe to the next Tanish Man Spiel Dog, I'm out.